This is Times Square. See a whole bunch of billboards. There's a lot of people out here. Whole bunch. Let's see a Tyra Banks show out here. And see some other shows. Like 106 and Park off the BET, if I'm not mistaken. That's the most shit I've ever seen in my life doing yoga. You have to go up fighting. Now we're going down the subway in Brooklyn, New York, and here's a glimpse of what it looks like. When you get to the subway, you see they have three different rails, so one, two, three. The third one right there is electrified, so if you went down there, you'd pretty much get electrocuted. And if you've ever seen that movie Cloverfield, you'll notice that it looks just like it. It's dark and it's not air conditioned, but the trains are, so if you're ready to go to New York, the subway is pretty much the easiest way for you to get around. I'm actually here in New York City. I'm at this store in Brooklyn. I'm near Brooklyn Heights and we found some shorts for four dollars. For South Pole shorts for four dollars. I cannot believe that. I'm gonna show y'all. Six ninety nine. Seven dollars. Oh boy. Three ninety nine dress shirts. Here we go. <laughs> Right now I'm in this place called Little Italy and you'll see a whole bunch of different bands and it's like the Taste of Chicago on a small little street here. Let's see little restaurants behind us as well out here in New York. We're looking at Manhattan now from Brooklyn. So I'm sure you're wondering how did I get over here? Well there's a couple of different ways. Of course you can use a boat and come across this body of water right here or you can take the Brooklyn Bridge which is over here and that goes from Manhattan to Brooklyn and then you, you know, take a taxi cab or something like that and then come over here to Brooklyn Heights right here if you can see it I don't know if you can I can't zoom in for far enough but that thing over there if you will is the Statue of Liberty so I have a pretty good view of the Statue of Liberty and you'll see several boats circling this massive piece of land in which the Statue of Liberty is located. So it's a it's very interesting when you get to see it up close and personal.